That tune you just heard was called The Yellow Barber, and I learned that tune from Buddy Thomas, Kentucky fiddle player. And uh, what I will attempt to do is to uh, slow this tune down and then break it down, and then I will speed it back up some and maybe play it at regular speed. But I'll, uh, the notes that I use is uh, my choice of notes. Uh, you can use your own choice of notes, just I'll have the dominant melody of the tune and you can go from that then. And uh, so uh, it's in the key of D. Try it again, uh, maybe up more to normal speed and uh
called Nine Mile Out of Louisville and uh, another Buddy Thomas tune. And um, so I'm going to try to break that down a little bit. Let's really slow this one down now. Now this tune is called the Big Indian Hornpipe. I learned it off of Buddy Thomas and he learned it from Jimmy Wheeler, a Portsmouth area fiddle player. And uh, we got a lot of good tunes off of Jimmy. But it's in a key of a... break it down for you and slow the parts down. Take this one down to low gear now.
Now I'll try it again, uh, maybe up more to normal speed, and uh, put in a little, uh, maybe a double strings, and make a little bigger sound out of it. And Snake Winder, and I learned this tune from Buddy Thomas also. He passed away in 1974, and he learned this tune from Morris Allen from Greenup County, Kentucky. And it'll be, uh, we'll do it the same way, we'll break it down. And it's in the key of G. Short Sedition. It's uh, kind of similar to one called Rachel, but it's a different tune actually. And it comes from Uncle Joe Stamper. Buddy learned it from uh, Uncle Joe, and then I learned it from Buddy in the key of D.
so I'll uh, try to break it down for you. Maybe I can try it just a little bit slower, maybe, for it. We'll slow this one down, it's not hard, it's just a little bit uh, unusual. <clears throat> now we're going to go off to a tune that's uh, in jig time. Uh, I learned this tune from George Lee Hawkins out of Bath County, Kentucky. And uh, I call it uh, Patty's Farewell. George said the name of it was uh, Patty Bidding Farewell to America. So uh, it's in the key of G. try to break this one down for you.
try to do it a little bit slower for you now. Try it a little slower now. Now, here's another tune I learned from George Lee Hawkins, and uh, the name of this tune is Greek Melody, and it's in uh, G minor. break it down for you. Try to do it a little bit slower for you.
let's really slow this one down. This next tune is uh, a tune comes from Charlie Kenny. Charlie was a good friend to everybody in the county around here, and uh, he's got to be uh, pretty famous since he's passed on. And uh, he was a good artist, a mountain artist, and uh, a good fiddle player, and just a good old gentleman along with it. But uh, he had a different way of playing. Charlie did, uh, and his, a lot of times you would think he would be cross keyed, but he wouldn't. He just played in standard. And it sounded like he was cross keyed, but uh, uh, it's a, really a very simple tune. But he made it sound like there was a lot going on in there, and I'll, we'll break it down and see what we can get out of it. And uh, I'll just play you a skeleton of it to start with. together and fatten it up and make a bigger sound out of it maybe. But uh, it goes like close attention to this it's a little bit tricky. Good. Thank you. 
we'll fatten that tune up and pull double strings in certain parts of it. It'll be like a... That's about it for this session, and I hope you get some good out of these tunes. A uh, pretty good batch of Kentucky-style fiddle tunes, and uh, use your own, choose your own notes and uh, your own phrasing on them, and they'll make you good tunes. But uh, if you have trouble finding the notes, uh, always remember just uh, usually it's the one right under your finger. Just drop it down, and that'll be it. <laughs> and uh, if I tell you any more than that, then we'll have to charge you more. <laughs>